Sometimes you just have to go for the low hanging fruit. And this was about as low hanging as I could get. Featured Styroxobasia, I don't remember, maybe it was last week or two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. And this is its cousin. And this is Styrax japonica. But this is Styrax japonica pink chimes. And it's really, really a pretty flower. Um, it is first week in June and it's in full bloom. And we'll bloom about a week, week and a half. And it's a really nice small tree. 15 feet or so max. Um, maybe 10 to 12 feet wide. So a good small space tree. Uh, we'll tolerate a little bit of shade. I wouldn't put it in den shade. It won't bloom as well in the plant will stretch. Always well-drained soil. And, you know, a nice accent piece, maybe to frame somewhere in a landscape, somewhere it's gonna get noticed, but a real nice pink pop of color. Wow, that's alliteration. My uh, second grade English teacher would be proud of me. Um, and, you know, can't you just see this with some Yuki Cherry Blossom Dutsia at the base, totally mirroring this flower? I'm getting a little too carried away here. So Styrex Japonica Pink Chimes blooms in June for a couple of weeks. Gets a green fruit that hangs down. Um, not very showy. Fall colors yellow. Uh, only deer issue with this plant could be rubbing, but not really any issues. And it's a fairly bulletproof tree. It really doesn't have a lot of problems. Definitely worth a try in the landscape. Styrex japonica pink chimes, Japanese snowbell.